Okay, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go File and Open. This is for rotoscoping. And I'm choosing my still image. Okay, I want that to be the biggest image I can. I'm going to open it. Okay, notice that in my animation timeline there's nothing there yet. And there's even this option here where I can switch it over. But what I, for rotoscoping, I want to be able to see something. So what I need to do is hit Command J. And when I do that, that gives me this this option here so this gives me some time but notice it's at still at 30 frames per second so it'll take you forever so what we need to do is we need to, to go to file and we need to export and we need to render the video now the couple important things make sure it's QuickTime if it's like MPG um, 4 it's going to distort it so QuickTime make sure that it's at document size and not something else in here and then down here where it says frame rate custom and change that to 12. So make sure it's got all those three things. So QuickTime, the document size, and custom. Okay, so I'm going to hit render. Okay, so once I've got that rendered, now I'm going to go, so this is just my old one here. I'm going to go file and I'm going to open. And I had named it Van Gogh and it's a movie. .mov is the QuickTime. So I'm going to click open. Notice that it changed down here to 12 frames per second. So at this point, what I can do is I can start doing any kind of um, animation with rotoscoping like I showed you before. Now one extra added tip, um, if, you, if you want you can you know draw straight over each of the frames, but if you wanted to separate the frames, you can go up to Layer, Video Layers, New, Blank, Video Layer, and see what happens there so that when I go to draw let me move this over a little bit so I'm gonna pick just some random color alright so and obviously my brush is huge okay so I'm in here and I'm making my little spiral and don't forget about the onion skin here right okay so I'm gonna forward it once let me forward it bring it back um, so I can onion skin, whatever I'm going to do, bring it forward, bring it forward. It's hard to see. Bring it forward. See, it, it comes across the face like that. So every time you do it, right, it's another kind of step. So if I bring this back, so I can hit play, you can see that was so quick, and that was within so remember 12 frames for every second so 12 drawings and it's only one second so you want to think about looping and stuff like that so um, once you're finished um, you can actually bring this part in however far you had it and you can keep looping it like that which is great okay so what you'll do is you'll go to file we are going to turn this into a video so we're going to export it you're going to render your video okay so if I were you I would call it like whatever it is okay and keep it remember the document size is important okay and you've got the that stays the same and render and it will pop up on your desktop as your finished one I'm going to pull it out here so you can see double click alright so this is what it looks like now we'll do something where it'll loop, so don't worry about, we'll have a looping ability for it. Okay.